Hello and welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we're gonna tell you how the cast of the Fall Guy 1981 has changed. I'll show you what they looked like back then in 1981 and now in 2022 how they've changed compared to when they were on this TV series. Alright, let's go. Douglas Barr in the TV series, he played Howie Munson. In 1981, he was 32 years old and now he's 73 years old. March. Hey, you read all that into me? Don't you know I studied psychology at both Columbia and Fordham. This is a classic case. The Laura complex. Sweet and delightful, really sexy, uh, and I wanted to hit on her and had no luck. That's about all I can remember beyond that. Lee Majors in the TV series he played called Severs. In 1981 he was 42 years old and now he's 83 years old. He's restless. I guess he's trying to say something. I can guess what it is. What? Who did this to him? We finally got married on the last movie. Uh, Thanks to Two hour movie. Sense. I finally said okay. Uh, Marky Post in the TV series, she played Terry Michaels. She was 32 years old in 1982, and it was with great sadness that Post passed away at her home in Los Angeles on August 7, 2021, at the age of 70. So the police turned into a hurricane. Listen, you know who these men are? Alvin Trump escaped from a federal penitentiary in Atlanta after bashing his cellmate over the head, stuffing him into a mattress. Mark Fig escaped from a hospital for the criminal. Oh! I mean, those don't bother me because it's, you know, it's so not true. I mean, it's oh. just so stupid. Is it true? Um, <laughs> no. Heather Thomas in the TV series, she plays Jody Banks. In 1981, she was 24 years old, and now she's 65 years old in the movies so now you do this no big deal uh, no listen to me when there's no work i help out friends of mine two friends who are bounty hunters so high they you got to understand they put a band-aid little x that big and then they say okay i want you to do a four-wheel slide into that and terry kisser in the tv series he plays crack rogers in 1981 he was 42 years old and now he's 83 years old there's going to be two guys walking through that door any second now, and they're not going to be as understanding with you as I am. Just when I tell you to run, run, okay? You can say, okay, is this what I want to do? Want to be an actor? Maybe I want to be a writer now? Maybe something else? Uh, but it turned out okay, and uh, I kept going. Joe Ann Flug in the TV series, she plays Samantha Big Jack Jack. In 1981, she was 41 years old, and now she's 82 years old. Work. You just can't go off and leave me like this. Oh, yes, I can. Cold? Where are you going? Cattle yeah, show. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one who's looking for the breeding farm, you remember him. What do you say? Oh, let go, you oh, fool. Yes. <laughs> Judith Chapman in the TV series, she plays Kay Faulkner. In 1981, she was 30 years old, and now she's 71 years old. I revoke her bond. You can't do that. Watch me. I take her to coach. That means she's going to go back to jail. That's the idea. Coach, she is the only one who can lead me to those two. You know, if there's a line in a film that's not quite right, you have to go into a studio and match your lips with the picture and loop it. So a little double meaning there, but she... Robert Donner in the TV series, he played Edmund Trench. In 1983, he was 52 years old. And it was with great sadness that he passed away on June 8, 2006 from an arrhythmia at the age of 75. You're not Colt Seavers. Give the man a cigar. I don't smoke. I'm Colt Seavers. What do you want? Huh? Ben Cooper in the TV series he plays director. In 1981, he was 48 years old. And it was with great sadness that he passed away on February 24, 2020 at the age of 86. I loved all of them. Um, I was so fortunate in that I, my attitude was that I just, they got, they let me play cowboy and they paid me. <laughs> William Bryan in the TV series, he plays the director. In 1982, he was 58 years old. And it was with great sadness that he passed away on June 26, 2001 at the age of 77. Up yonder. Oh no, sir, we would never do that. I certainly hope not. The only way to find out is to know whether you're exceeding the allowable 0.3 per million is to stand a look. Doug McClure in the TV series, he played Anthony Martin. In 1982, he was 47 years old. 
and he was with great sadness that on February 5th, 1995, McClure died at the age of 59 of lung cancer. The rest of it. I could have walked through that stunt with one hand tied behind my back. Maybe I should have tried it that way. Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next video.